Good morning, friends, and happy Friday. Um, it is about 8.30 in the morning, and Brian left about an hour ago to go get some blood work done, an echo done, and something else done, and then he just called me and said, you have to make an appointment. And like, I've never had to make an appointment before. You just get this order, and you can go and get this done. That's what I did with my mom a couple weeks ago. She had this order. She just went to the hospital. It's an outpatient thing. You just go have it done. Well, he said, no, you have to have an appointment. So they gave him a phone number, and now he has to have an appointment. Craziness. Anyway, um, but I am about ready to leave and go get my nails done. I just kind of wanted to show you guys quickly what I have on. Um, something very, very just comfortable and relaxed. A pair of leggings with this really long oversized uh, t-shirt. I absolutely love this t-shirt. I didn't think that I would, but because it's like super long and it like it's like really long. Look how look it like covers up your bum, and I just think it's so great um it covers up the front fupa i love it and then i just kind of paired it with a, a cardigan um you can it's a short sleeve shirt too so you can like put a cardigan on with it so it's really really nice but it's just super comfortable and i think it's amazing especially with a pair of leggings so you're like very comfortable so i'm just going to throw on a pair of like um tennis shoes and walk out of the house with this on. I, if I can, I might actually talk Brian into going to get a pedicure. I highly, highly doubt that he will, but I'm going to give it a shot anyway and see if he wants to go have one done. But I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna guess no. But he also took the day off to get, you know, to, because for one, we thought his parents were gonna be here and they obviously decided to leave early Wednesday morning, so they're not here, even though he did take the day off. Um, but he took it off too because he was gonna go get that blood work and stuff done. Oh, I think I'll just wear these. Which a lot of you guys have asked me the other day, did you ever go get your black and white checkered shoes? And the answer is yes, I did. I went and got my black and white checkered shoes. Um, they did not have any in my size at Shoe Carnival, so I ended up having to go to Kohl's and get them and um, love them. So that's what I will be wearing is my black and white checkered shoes with this outfit, which is spot on great. So I'm about ready to head on out though and go get my nails done. I thought he'd be here by now, but he's not. So I guess I'll just have to wait. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go get my nails done, and uh, I don't know what else is on for the, the docket for the day. Um, I'm sure we'll figure it out. So, let's go get the nails done. finished with my nails I ran into Publix like really really quick and picked up just a few things uh, to last us for like over the weekend um, and uh, some of you guys have asked when I get my nails done can I please show the color of my nails when I get them done and absolutely I just got them done flat black again so our matte black so that is the color that I got both my um, hands and my toes done. I absolutely love that color. I was trying to see if I would have liked another color this time around, but just wasn't feeling another color. So I um, just stuck with the black because I really love the black right now. So ooh, I can't wait till they're finished with all this construction on our road. Ooh, it'd be so nice. But all these houses though are, are built those are really done on this road then they should be almost finished with um construction on our road which is amazing and then they'll start with all those houses back in that way but alrighty pulling in the driveway and I will um, see you guys uh, later on a little bit good morning friends and happy Sunday I am on my way to Target right now to hopefully get that um, outdoor rug that I shared with you guys ooh, about a week or so ago. Um, I'm hoping that it's still there. Um, if not, then obviously I'll kick myself in the behind for not getting it when 
I saw it there first. Um, but we're hoping and hoping and crossing our fingers that it's there. Um, I also wanted to go possibly back into home goods really quick. I'm not sure I might be able to get what I'm looking for at um, at uh, hot at a target. So we shall see. But yeah, today is going to be just a run to the quick target with me and then I think I might do a little bit of decorating a little more in the dining room I'm just trying to kind of do something different in the dining room and then I got the approval <laughs> the approval from Brian <laughs> to do a board and batten um, uh, design behind our bed so um i said well we could probably do it he's like oh yeah no mm -mm, no i'll no i'm not doing it he goes like i'm i'm done doing that type of stuff he thinks it's really hard it's not that hard i mean you just line it up make sure there's a straight line put that board and batten up juke 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 done and then do the ones that go down juke 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 done uh, but he's like no no uh-uh no <coughs> excuse me <coughs> excuse me uh, he said no that if I can just come have someone come out and do it, then I can have someone come out and come out and do it. I'm like, okay, cool. So I got the okay for that. Um, so <laughs> because I got the okay for that, I'm going to probably do a little bit more around the house. <laughs> um, our dining room already has that design. Um, but I was hoping to do, you know, a little bit more. I wanted to possibly, I think I might do it in the guest bedroom um, on the opposite wall maybe of what I'm, uh, maybe the whole wall. I don't know yet. I think I'm going to do it there too though because I think that would be kind of pretty um, to do it on that wall in the guest bedroom and then paint paint above it and I was even thinking some really fun in our bedroom some like a, a, a cool looking um like wallpaper I think like a white wallpaper with um, a little bit of like gray design in it I think would be very very pretty um, so because obviously the rest of the room is kind of like that grayish color on the wall and I just kind of change up the bedding and all that stuff anyway so I still think it would look really nice with just that little bit of gray if I can find something like that um, I it's a possibility that I might do that as well um, but uh, for, for, for the first First thing I have to do is find someone to come out and do that board and batten for me um, so um, yeah so I'm just like oh, I'm just kind of you know I told him I wanted this done when we lived in Georgia and he was so reluctant never wanted to do it which is ridiculous and I'm like you know what this is I'm living in this house I, I want to have it in a style that I like and, um, and it's so inexpensive and it's so easy to do and and it's so beautiful and it creates such a beautiful um, design and room and space so I really want um, that to happen so I'm gonna be working on that this week <laughs> trying to get someone to come out and do that for me so that is what I'm going to be working on but right now I'm gonna head to Target I'm gonna pick up a few things that I need I think Brian and I are gonna cook on the grill later I think we might do some burgers and uh, maybe a hot dog or two um, but yeah I think that's gonna be fun so yeah let's uh, let's go to Target and let's see what I can find and what I'm I, I know what I'm looking for so as soon as I see it then I'll know that's why I kind of wanted to go into home goods because home goods has pretty much exactly what I'm looking for so and home goods isn't open until 10 it's already 10 after 9 I can do it I got it all right let's do it so I am looking in the Barbie section for the Chelsea dolls for Parker because she's into the Chelsea's because they're just little small Barbies see how cute they are and then I came over here and I saw this one like this Barbie has put on some weight like these are like thick Barbies I like the thick Barbies <laughs> It's better than like unrealistic Barbie. Those are hilarious. I love those. But they have like so many different Barbies. Like what? All these Barbies, like a wheelchair Barbie. What? Barbie stuff. Oh, see like these are the little Chelsea's. How cute are the little Chelsea's? Chelsea can be an ice skater. 
That's cute. And this is another like little Chelsea. This is a Chelsea. Oh, how cute are these? These are adorable. Like this one has a little floaty. How cute. This one is a hamburger Chelsea. Oh, those are adorable. How cute. And I know she's getting like the Barbie dream house. So that's so cute. Alrighty. So I got that stuff for Parker for her. These are for their Easter baskets. And now I have to get something for little man, Lukey. Alrighty. So I got the rug and it actually fits in here. I was really um, thinking that it wouldn't, but it does. So I also got a lot of the stuff for the uh, baby's Easter baskets while I was here as well. I'll share everything with you guys once I get home. Um, but now I'm gonna run into home goods really quick and see if I can find what I'm looking for. Alrighty guys, so I'm gonna show you guys really quick all of the stuff that I picked up while I was out today. Um, <clears throat> I went ahead and got all of the kiddos their Easter baskets. This is for Lucas, for Liliana, and for Parker. And um, last year I had bought Parker and Lucas Easter baskets that they were supposed to give back to me for every year. Um, and Parker did. She didn't want to, but she did. And um, <clears throat> I don't know what I did with it. <laughs> I think it's probably upstairs somewhere, but I just don't remember where. And I honestly have not come across it um, during my time of getting in and out of the um, attic to uh, get my Easter stuff out. So <clears throat> I just went ahead and bought her another one. It's no big deal. Um, but this year I got to add a little extra one on there for Liliana. Now Lucas last year had a little blue one and um, he never, he didn't give that back to me. He didn't want to. Um, <clears throat> so I went ahead and got him a different one for this year. And this is just a cute little one about with dinosaurs on it because he's so into dinosaurs and cars. So um, I got him the dinosaur bucket so he could actually keep this and maybe put all of his little dinosaurs in there as well. And then um, for, I'm not exactly sure if I want to give this one to Liliana or if I want to give this one to Liliana. I'm thinking more this one and then giving this one to Parker because it's kind of got some really cute little unicorns and stuff on there, which um, Parker kind of loves little unicorns and stuff too. She loves anything really. Um, so I got her this one and then um, for Liliana, I just got her this cute little pink one with some little like, rainbows on it. Um, each one of them is going to have a little bit of grass to put inside of their Easter basket. So I have grass for each one. And then um, the reason why I got them, well, even though it's a week from today, um, is because that way I'll know exactly what each one of them has and if I need to put anything extra in there. Because I always want to try to make sure that they each have something equal. You know what I mean? So, um, and I don't think Liliana can actually drink these just yet. I don't think she can. She's like six months old, seven months old. I don't think that she can, but that's okay. Um, uh, but anyway, so I picked up um, three of these little juicy box things and I'm going to put one each inside of their little uh, basket. And if you guys are interested to like, um, to know like how I put their baskets together or whatever, um, I will do that this week um, if you guys are interested in that. But I'm just kind of showing you what I'm putting in each one. Um, <clears throat> then this is for uh, Parker because she likes Peppa Pig. Um, this is for Parker, Big Parker, because she likes the little Chelsea Barbies. We talked about that in Target. And then um, I got her another little Chelsea baby for her little basket. And then, um, obviously, little chocolate, one for Parker, one for Lucas. Obviously, little baby can't have those just yet. And then I got them some kisses each. Both of them are going to have, like, little kisses in their baskets. And then, let's see. Oh, my goodness. So, this basket is actually going to go in my um, entryway on my little... Um, Hutch, what is that thing called? Hall tree? That's where that basket's gonna go. Um, these are for Parker. These are gonna go in her basket as well. Um, these are for Lucas. He's gonna have a little bit, some cars in here. 
Um, we got some Colgate toothpaste. I'm not gonna put these in their baskets, but these are gonna go in our basket. <laughs> um, <clears throat> this is for baby. This is baby, Babies Love Easter. So this is gonna be a cute little book that she's gonna get for her. Um, a basket. This is one for Lucas, and it just says "Never touch dino never touch a dinosaur," and each one is kind of like a little um, touch, different sensory thing, which is really really cool. Um, so that goes in Lucas's basket, and then um, she um, Parker's gonna get Happy Easter Mouse. I feel like I have a lot of stuff here for Parker. She was just a lot easier to buy for than Lucas was. Um, and then I got these for Lucas these little insulated um, dinosaur drinky things. And each one of them, even little baby, got a Pez. So let me get all their little Pez out. Little little Pez for the Lammy. Oh, there should be one more in here. Yeah, the little um, Lammy one and then a little Chicky one for Lucas's. And then one for Parker's. Oh my goodness, do I need to get a bigger basket? <laughs> um, because leave it to Auntie. Auntie always gets all the great things. And then I got him this little set of Hot Wheels because he's like, like I said, into cars and dinosaurs. And then um, this is for little baby. Do 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 do. Just a little bunny. And um, let's see. And then some eggs that I'm gonna put in Lucas's and Parker's. And then I got me some allergy relief stuff because my allergies are killing me all. So that's what I got at Target besides the rug. So I did get the rug and my battery is dying. Alrighty, so the other thing that I got were these cushions that are gonna go out back on the chairs back there. And I'll put those on in a little bit. We have all this stuff right here. Oh, I didn't change the battery yet. These have to be burned. Alrighty, and then the stuff that I picked up at Home Goods, um, these are just adorable. This is the cutest little bunny garland I've ever seen, and I had to grab it. Um, this is a table runner that I'm actually going to use, but I'm not going to use this side. I'm going to use this side because I could not find one this color. So I'm actually going to switch this one out and put this one on here. And then I got these napkins, which I did not want these ones with the little eggs. I wanted these ones with the stripes. So whatever it is what it is so i'm going to go ahead and take this one off and then put that one on that's what I wanted to do is I just kind of wanted to do a little nice little table setting with four settings and that's how simple I wanted to keep it I don't particularly care for the gold but that's the only ones that I have available right now and I think I'm gonna fix the centerpiece up a little bit because I'm not exactly thrilled with how big this vase is with these flowers but you guys know what I'm trying to go for here I'm working on it Alrighty, so I have changed my clothes and I am about ready to go outside and take all the chairs off of the patio. And then um, Brian's gonna help me move the table off and then we will be able to put down the new rug. And I'm very, very excited about that. So I actually um, already put the cushions on this chair and put the little pillows over here so it looks really really cute so and then these are going to go to courtney and then this
So I think I'm gonna go ahead and actually end the vlog here. Um, I actually have some laundry that I want to get done and then um, focus on figuring out what we're gonna do for like lunch and dinner-ish. So we'll probably have, it'll probably be like a mixture of both. So I'll have a lunch and dinner. Um, so yeah, Brian's out there painting. He's gonna be wore out, but yeah, he's just painting around the brick that's out there. His back's gonna be killing him. But anyway, he wants to get that part done uh, before the end of the day. So um, like I said, I'm just gonna go ahead and fold up some uh, clothes that I have sitting here on the bed and then probably take a shower because I was just outside and all that nasty ugh, pollen. And um, I feel all mucky and I was getting irritated in my eyes because of it. So I'm gonna take a shower and then uh, chill for the rest of the day, but thank you guys so much for hanging out with me um, If you guys uh, you know what though? I wanted to hang on back up reverse that um, Yesterday um, I did not finish um, vlog. I didn't vlog anything yesterday uh, Brian and I went out to the furniture store and I picked up a new piece that will be delivered on Tuesday however they do not deliver and I was like okay because we were gonna buy it like right then and there and um, because they don't deliver we just like walked out but she took my name and my number and she said if she could figure out somebody somehow to, to deliver it here she would so no sooner we got out um, and in the car by the red light there by the store, she called and she said, hey Angie, she goes, I figured it out. She goes, I have someone who will pick this up and deliver it to your house. So if you guys wanna come back. So we turned around and went back and I ended up buying um, this piece of furniture, which I'll put a picture of in right here for you guys. And it's gonna go in the living room um, on the other wall. So that should be here on Tuesday. So I'm excited about that. And then we went to lunch and it was so cold yesterday that it's so windy that I didn't even bother like vlogging or anything like that but um, I do want to just show you guys what I bought at the furniture store and like I said it'll be here on Tuesday but that is it that is it thank you guys so much for hanging out with me this weekend I hope that you guys enjoyed the little bit that I did share if you did huge thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next one bye